I'm getting to the point where like at South by Southwest, uh, which is coming up, we're speaking about the fifth industrial revolution and we're talking about um, the profound impact that data centers will have on humanity. But at the same, at the after party for South by Southwest, my I'm doing a completely different panel and that panel is called the last industrial revolution because I have to address the need of energy to support the adoption rate of emerging technology, specifically around the surge and demand of AI, that energy is... Uh, finite, where uh, it's untenable based on the way that the U.S. grid is capable of producing and putting power on the grid relative to the amount of demand that the energy provider or the energy um, giants that are sucking down the most, which are the the largest cloud operators, the largest AI operators, and the data center owner operators that that house them when they're not building for their own. So those are really the three categories. And right now. You have a lot of people that are, you know, not in my backyard, not over there either. And I don't want this on power and I don't want that on power. And at the end of the day, we have a five-year head start. Are we have, uh, China claims that by the year 2030, they will overtake America with regards to AI because they have the ability to generate so much energy and power. They'll do 100 power plants, coal power plants in China alone. Yeah. They have 31 nuclear reactor programs going on right now, 10 for the last three years, with the exception of last year, which they had 11 commissioned. My thing are, are authorized to start. My thing is national security is still a factor, right? So we are sitting here talking about a problem, which is a first a good first world problem to have. We're a country that has so many things that like, oh, we don't have enough power, but if we want to, we can go poop power on here and poop power on there and do all these things, unlike a secondary or third tier country. But at the same time, we are now getting to a point where most of the emerging technologies that we are using, they came from America too. Facebook, Apple, Microsoft, Google, Amazon, Oracle, uh, uh, IBM, Soft, you name it, most of these technology users are also American born. We are going to lose the dominance that we have on AI to China by 2030.